Hello again. Today I am coming uh, to you with a uh, short mystery envelope baseball card video. This is what I purchased. It was 10 card baseball mystery packs, two guaranteed hits, and then the best card that you could possibly get is the Mike Trout shown on here, which is a uh, looks like it is a cut of uh, part of the one of the the letters on his jersey with an autograph number to 15. Um, the user here uh, now only shows with uh, two feedback. When I got this, it was zero feedback. So I am taking quite a risk. And I think the seller realized that he wasn't charging enough for shipping. So he raised the price to $7.50. So he added $1.50 after I had uh, made my purchase. And I don't think I'm getting the trout because I'm one of the first people to come in here and buy this. But the envelope came in today. Let's take a look and see what I got. I like how the seller added this note here, please handle with care. So uh, he just, he did not ship this with any kind of tracking label. It just had a regular stamp on it. And let us see what is in the envelope. On the front here we have Skip Schumacher. I am not holding out a lot of hope after seeing that as one of our first cards on here. But we should still get a couple of hits. Next card is Bobby Abreu. Maybe a, a little bit of a better player. Next we have Tim Hudson. Uh, this guy has a lot from uh, 2012 tops. J.D. Martinez. Darwin Barney. And then finally something that isn't uh, from that year. We have Jerry Owens rookie card. So far, and still not looking too good. We've got a uh, Nationals rookie of Ross Detweiler. And a rookie of Matt Carson. So far, I'm not thinking this is worth a dollar, but I think we have our two hits coming up. So hopefully this will make it all pay off. That is not a hit. We have Edwin Diaz. Number to 2019, and a Michael Pineda, number to 2019. I just look at the envelope one more time. No, nothing left in the envelope. So, in this guy's world, a hit was a common card, number to 2019. So, this one is going to be a big no. Not worth it at all. So, well, I'd, uh, have to go through the bad ones to find the good ones, I guess. And uh, uh, I hope you uh, learned the lesson from me. Don't buy from this seller unless you liked these cards. All right. Thanks for watching. Bye.